search warrant. Republicans, you've heard them. They have been also attacking the FBI over this investigation. Let's listen to some of this. The FBI raid of President Trump is a complete abuse and overreach of its authority. Do I know that the boxes of material they took from our lago that they won't put things in those boxes to entrap him? I will make sure these tyrants pay the price. The way our federal government has gone is it's like what was thought about the Gestapo or people like that, but they just go after people. More recently, Trump's social network actually amplified a conservative report with the personal information of the FBI agents who were involved in the search. Are Trump and some Republicans putting the lives of the FBI's men and women at risk? Well, the GOP is going to be the party of supporting law enforcement. Law enforcement includes the FBI. As United States Attorney, I work with the FBI, the DEA, the federal law enforcement agencies. Those folks on the ground do extraordinarily heroic efforts to enforce our rule of law, which is fundamental uh, to the Republican Party and to our democracy. The FBI is part of that. And so, yes, we need to pull back on, on uh, casting judgment on them. No doubt that the uh, higher-ups in the FBI has made mistakes. They do it. Uh, I've uh, defended cases as well, and I've seen uh, uh, you know, wrong actions. But we uh, cannot say that whenever they uh, went in and did that search that uh, uh, they were not doing their job as law enforcement officers. If you want to hold people accountable, it is the Department of Justice. It is the Attorney General who said he supervised that. The FBI is simply carrying out their responsibilities under the law, a lawful search warrant uh, that uh, a magistrate just signed off on. And uh, they didn't go in there with FBI raid jackets. Uh, they tried to constrain uh, their behavior carrying out that warrant. So let's be, uh, let's support law enforcement. Let's stand with them, uh, whether it's the DEA, the FBI, or your local law enforcement. That's critically important that we do that uh, because they're simply trying to do their job and uh, to keep anarchy away from our country. I want to talk to you about abortion because Arkansas has done something interesting. Arkansas, yes, has an unenviable record on maternal and infant care, but you've taken some steps to improve care for mothers and infants, like expanding Medicaid coverage for pregnant women. If you are going, you know, if Republican states are going to force women to have babies they wouldn't otherwise have had, do those Republican-led states need to support them more because many states are not doing this? Uh, well, the answer is yes, and I hope that uh, we're all looking at that because in Arkansas, uh, because uh, we had a trigger law that